Hi YouTube, it's Liz and I am back um, with another Orla, Orla Kylie um, piece. Uh, this one is, I believe, it's called the um, Organizer. It's slightly smaller. Um, actually, it's a bit smaller. This this is the bigger one behind here, and you can kind of see the the different size. Um, it's actually drastically bigger. So um, you know, so that's that's that. So um, so you can kind of see, you know, the the size difference. Now, um, if you haven't seen the um, I don't know if I mentioned, this is the Sweet Pea Collection, but um, if you haven't seen the review and what I use this for, um, go ahead uh, to my channel. It it's, should be up pretty soon. So Now, this is what I, um, I, what I use this for is actually my pharmacy bag. Um, my pharmacy bag, I uh, do carry it around uh, every single day. And um, this is a um, treated canvas, and so it's very, you know, very sturdy. So this is what it looks like all opened up. So, I mean, it has the... Um, a zippered power to see through uh, along with this one and of course this initially has uh, like a tube like um, pocket here but I just broke the seam there and or popped the stitch and so that it's one big pouch so I have two pouches instead of um, three so um, I carry this around with me um, every single day, I adjust to it as I see fit. So, um, yeah, so let's get into this. This was $16.99, and it is only sold at Target. Um, it's a really good find. I really do like it. Uh, again, um, as I mentioned in my previous uh, video, I, I, I really, I found um, organized, like, Jen, organized like Jen, she is amazing. I love her. She's just just like me. Her bag, she loves a good bag, uh, organizing and labels and um, uh, filofaxes and planners and whatnot. So she's definitely my um, one of my mentors per se. So anyways, let's jump into my pharmacy bag. So um, in this first pocket here, what um, I have is of course, as you see, our you know, feminine items. Uh, my flu for kids. My husband and my middle son get really bad allergies, so I always keep, um, this one is Allegra, and I cut off the instructions for each one, and then I put, um, you know, what the, you know, I'm sorry, what the, you know, what it is, and on the back of it. So... That way I don't have the whole hunkin', you know, box in there. So, again, I did it for the kids as well. This one already had it, and I just wrote kids because I really didn't see it say kids on there. So. so I keep that in that pouch. I also keep, you know, a random comb in there. These are adult daytime soft gels and this one is for um, it has acetaminophen it's um, for just kind of you know cough and cold so um, you know I, I already know that this is you know take two you know so 
And um, these are child um, meltaways, acetaminophen. A matches, you just never know. And cough drop and um, cold sore medication. Um, you know, whenever my kids and I have, you know, colds, we, we tend to get the cold sores that kind of come with it. So, unfortunately. So, let's stick this stuff back in here so that we can move on. And it fits a lot of stuff. I could definitely fit more in there. And then onto this middle pouch. It's not filled. It's definitely room to grow, which I'm really excited about. So I kidnapped this from my daughter. It's just a Paul Frank little metal tin. I put Splenda sweeteners, you know, and it fits. It's a perfect little fit. So, you know, you never know. Sometimes they just don't have your sweetener where you go, so I like that. Um, a hand sanitizer. This one is crisp golden pear. It smells really fresh. Um, I have a, a lipstick hue by MAC. And then uh, French lavender and honey uh, eau, de, um, eau de perfume by Bath and Body Works. And then I always carry this around. I really like it. It's uh, Burt's Bees and this is lemon butter cuticle cream. So, I mean, I change the middle compartment up quite often, um, considering, you know, like, I don't know, I guess the comb can go there now. So, it, it, it changes up, so. And then I'm just going to flip this around. Like I said before, I popped the stitch here. It was just a little tiny, I mean, you can kind of see um, the stitching that was here. It was kind of, um, to me, it was, I mean, people find... I saw some reviews on this, and I did see, you know, some people stick uh, one tube of lipstick in there, and it was just, it didn't fit me. And then I saw one person actually was able to pop the stitch, and I was like, ooh, I'm, I'm doing that. So I did it, and you can, as you can see, you can fit a lot more stuff in there. I mean, so in this first little compartment, um, I have this MAC Ziploc pouch that I believe, what came in here? don't remember what came in here, but I'm sure all you makeup gurus know that you can get this with like the sponges or something. So I kept it and I stuck, you know, Q-tips and band-aids in there. Yes. And I also have um, a paper clip in there and I had paper clipped some of the um, band-aids together. So, um, you know, if I do need a paper clip, I know this is where I would, if I really need one, that's where I would go to. And then in this next pouch, I have about, <laughs> I have a lot of these just because we go through them a lot, are these super C's, um, uh, so emergencies, immunity boost, um, hydrates, and protects. So these are always good to have. They're the little tiny travel size ones. So I have four of those. And then I have these Crayola tissues can never go wrong with those. And then I got this at the dollar section at Target. It's one of those pill cases. And I do have my vitamin D's in there. So that is my um, pharmacy case. Um, this is, um, I don't know if I mentioned it, this is. Um, coated canvas and it is very easy to clean. You just um, wipe it off with a cloth and that's it. Uh, I do again carry this every day. I do change it up. I do you know it's so it's so convenient. I don't I I, I can't say enough good things. It's good quality. Um, initially I did think that um, you know, sixteen ninety nine was, you know, a little pricey for a makeup bag, but you know, it's if you use it every single day, like um, you know, 
the way that I do, I think it's a very good a good price for it. Um, again, you can find it at uh, the Target store. You, um, I don't believe you can buy it online. Um, you might be able to, and then I think you're able to like ship it to a store or something. This one was very hard for me to find. Um, so, but it's definitely worth the hunt. Um, I, I know a lot of, um, organizers, scrapbookers, um, you know, they use it to put, um, their scissors, their stickers, their, um, I'm starting to kind of get into that. They put their, you know, little things like that into, sorry, I'm just grabbing from my little, my little case here that I have full of my little... You know, little stickers and and whatnot. They usually they can which fits perfectly in there. They usually use that for that as well. So that might be a really good um, fit for you. I know that um, a pocket size Filofax fit in he, fits in here, and you know you can carry that every day with you. I might get another one. This is the Sweet Pea collection. I do believe it comes in the Graphite collection which I might get one in that collection as well just to have as a um, for like these you know for my file of, for my you know my planner stuff so um, you know you know, if you have any other suggestions on other, you know, pieces I can try out, um, please let me know. If you have um, suggestions on another video that I could do, let me know as well. As I did say in my review of my um, of my weekender, um, I will be coming out with a review of my. Um, my, I mean, my new Michael Kors core. Oh my goodness, tongue tie. My new Michael Kors bag. So just stay tuned for that. If you have any other suggestions on a video, go ahead and leave that in the comment bar. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you. Bye bye.